Hello everyone! Welcome to a video. I'm finally gonna be putting makeup on my face. It's literally been at least a whole entire month, if not more, since I have put makeup on my face. This is crazy. Uh, for those of you who don't know who I am, my name is Marquette and I like to slather stuff on my face and that is exactly what I'm gonna be doing today. Finally. I already have my face done. I know I haven't done my makeup in over a month. However, of course, in typical Marquette fashion, I wanna do something over the top and dramatic. I don't wanna do something simple and easy. So, <laughs> of course it's gonna be crazy. I'm sure you can tell by the title down below. Today, I'm gonna to be doing Cruella de Vil. I don't know why, I don't know where it came from. I don't know, I don't know, but we're doing it, it's happening. So anyway, we're just gonna jump right in and I'm gonna go ahead and start doing my eyebrows. And I'm using M Cosmetics eyeliner. This is probably the easiest possible way for me to do my eyebrows and it's very different and it's very dramatic, but isn't that what Cruella de Vil is? There we go, a very dramatic dark eyebrow. And then I'm going to use the white paint from this for the white eyebrow. that doesn't look too incredibly awful. I like it. I think I'm okay with it. I'm filming with my dog, Queen, and so far she's doing pretty good. She had the zoomies earlier and she kind of ran into the corner of the bed that's back here. <laughs> and I've never, I've never heard her yelp the way that she did. That was really scary. She's fine. I checked her out. She's completely fine. I think she was more startled than anything because she was going crazy and then boop. I don't think it was a hard hit. I don't really know. I had my back to her when she ran into it, but she's fine. She's just playing with her toy and kind of just looking around the room. Hi, baby girl. Hi. Do you have the hiccups? Do you have the hiccups? Yeah, do you have the hiccups? Come here. Come here. Say hi. Hello. Doggy. I love you. Thank you. Thank you. She's like, oh, I've never tasted that on your face before, mommy. Oh, I tasted my armpit. I love you. Where's, where's my toy? Where's your toy? Go get your toy. Go get your toy. I realized that I could have used Jeffree Star Cosmetics um, Drug Lord for this, but that's okay. It's already on there. It's already done. So I'm just going to go in with kind of like a flatter brush and go into the white paint. and I'm gonna do the same thing on the other side, except I'm gonna be using the black paint from this. I think I was just a little bit more cautious with it, so it came out not terribly. Now, I'm going to put little like polka dot eyeliner. Obviously on this side it'll be black dots and on this side it'll be white dots. And for that I'm going to be using These are little tools 
uh, that are used for nail art and I bought them literally to make little polka dots for makeup. <laughs> That's what we're gonna be doing and again, I'm still gonna be using this paint. So I definitely think that this would have been easier to achieve with either a liquid lipstick or some kind of paint that dries, not this kind of paint like this, uh, just because it's kind of, it's difficult to hold it in place is the problem. But I'm still gonna keep going. I always end up making this side looking better than that side. I don't know if it's because I'm reaching across or what. But this is clearly my superior side. Okay, so this happened while we were away on the commercial break. Yeah, so I just had to like match it over on the other side. I do like how I redid that. It looks a little bit better, a little bit better not great but it is what it is so for those of you who are Cruella de Vil fans and we know that her eyeshadow is green I am going to be attempting to use this green in the Pat McGrath palette that's the word uh. This color is freaking beautiful. Yeah, I really like that. I know a lot. I know some people don't really like this look, but it's not your face. right here. I think I'm gonna put some blush on and I think it's gonna be a nice red blush from Likely Makeup Clown Blush. Was this dramatic? Yes. Do I care? No. Okay, so I took the dog out, not with these eyelashes on, but I took the dog out and it was like the quickest. I was like, just go and come back. Uh, I gave her a treat because she, she likes to normally walk around the complex and I was like not this time next time I'll take you on a double round if you want uh, anyway I just did this hack where you put your eyelash glue on the lashes and on your eyelid and then you let it dry for five minutes yes I let it dry for five minutes I even went on a walk I went outside to let the dog pee and then came back in and it freaking worked. I put this lash on a little bit too far over to the left, but like it, it's literally like a magnet. I'm not even kidding you. you literally just right on there. Uh, okay, so for lips, I'm going to be using Gerard Cosmetics Man Eater. It's just a very dark red and I love it. It smells like cherries. color I really love this okay last but not least I have a wig this is the final look I think my least favorite part is the blush which I don't know what I would do different maybe I wouldn't even put blush on at all I'm not really sure 
The only other thing that I don't really like is the lash that's all the way over, but that was a simple mistake. That just is something that I can, I can practice. I really love the green. I love the white and the black. I love the lip color. I like, I even like that it's a gloss because it's just like, hello, look at my lips. Oh, hold on. Let me see how it looks. like it anyhow I did have a lot of fun doing this look I hope you had fun watching I know it's not the best that I've done but I really had a good time with it if you want to stick around feel free to subscribe it's free it doesn't cost anything except for one millisecond of your time pressing the button feel free to comment and feel free to follow me on any of my other social media platforms which will be linked down below I will have the majority of everything that I use linked down below as well Probably not the wig came from Party City. No, it came from Spirit Halloween. <laughs> anyway, I'm going to end it here. Once again, thank you so much for watching, and I hope you have a great day. Bye. At least that's what I have envisioned in my head. What are you chewing on? Hold on. Oh, you're not chewing on anything? You're not chewing this? What? Okay. I'll take it. Hi again. You want to say hi to everybody again? Hello. 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 <laughs> My mom voice is really annoying. Thank you for the kisses. No biting. No biting. Okay. Ah. Oh. She's very attention needy. She's going to jump up here again. Yep, there it is. No. Ah. Oh. Thank you. Lay down. Go lay down. Go lay down. Where's your toy? Go get rough. Go get rough. Go get Ralph. No, do not, no. Off. Go get Ralph. Go lay down. Go lay down, I know. She's giving me puppy dog eggs and licking my knee. No, off, off. No, go lay down. Go lay down. Hold on, I wanna make sure that she's taken care of before I start doing my makeup. Can you see that? There's like little stray hairs that are coming out and I don't want that to mess everything up. I don't want to go out looking like this because we don't have a backyard so I literally have to walk her around the neighborhood and I'm just gonna look like crazy because my hair is gonna be crazy it's just a black and white wig obviously <laughs> I don't know if I'm gonna change my outfit even though this is totally not Cruella de Vil at all uh, maybe I'll just take this down and make her look a little naked let's see what happens